We have an update to one of our top local stories at ClickToHouston.com. Surveillance video captures a hair salon owner using a broom to fight off armed robbers. At one point, the owner was grazed by a bullet, in fact. This happened at Rose's African Hair Braiding on Homestead in Northeast Houston. Channel 2's Phil Archer spoke with the owner's wife. He's live now with that interview. Phil? Well, when that gang of armed robbers tried to hold up the shop and everyone in it, the owner fought back with the only weapon he had. Essentially, he brought a broom to a gunfight, but he still came out on top. Louise Mayhop admires her husband more now than ever before. My husband is an hero because he saved our lives. His name is Andre Olinga, and he's the guy who went up against an armed robber with a broom and won. When they came in, there was a... Like, Everybody, your purse, your phone, money, everybody, your purse, your phone. It happened August 2nd. The gunman and his friends burst through the front door and began roughing up customers. Mr. Olinga was sitting at the back of the room and finding no other weapon. First, he charged with the broom and then with his bare hands. During the fight, the guy with the pistol fired it, grazing Olinga's head, but that didn't slow him down. He pushed all of the would-be robbers out the front door and locked it. Later, police found the pistol on the floor, and today you can still see the bullet hole in the back wall. The couple built their hair braiding business on the city's east side after immigrating to Houston from Cameroon. Louise says she asked her husband why he decided to risk his life to defend it. He was afraid, but he said, he said that he, he, don't want, he, he don't want the guy to go out with people's purses and money, and he said, I know, they don't deserve that. They say he has to do what he has to do. This guy is a hero, in, in my opinion, all day long. Robert Detective Jeff Bryden says it's hard not to admire what Mr. Olinga did, but... Do I recommend for somebody to do something like this? Absolutely not. And that's because, too often, the good guys aren't so lucky. Mr. Olinga was out of town on business today, so he couldn't talk to us about it. But he's beefed up security at the shop, and Crime Stoppers is offering a reward to help find the guys that he swept out the front door. Reporting live at Houston Police Headquarters, I'm Phil Archer, KPRC Channel 2 News.